Hi, I'm Eric Lund, founder of Veris Technologies. We developed this core scan to be able to look into the profile in a way that's never really been able to be done before with, with such great uh, probing intensity that you can fully characterize a field. Let's just talk about the product a little bit. First of all, in order to do this, it has to be built strong. We got it attached to a tractor here, it can also be attached to a pickup or a utility vehicle. It's controlled by a set of controllers that uh, have Bluetooth data transmission capability to a tablet that's logging the data, has a built-in GPS. In order to be able to map a field intensely and, and, and quickly, you have to have an automatic probe. You can't have the operator, you know, having to get off the vehicle and run controls. In order to get, you know, a probe every acre in just a few seconds, it's got to be automatic. And we've designed this with, with great autonomy. As soon as the tractor or vehicle stops, the sensor probe goes down, comes back automatically. And if it hits a, something like a rock that's going to cause damage, it retracts immediately. It, it'll be great once tractors are automated because there's really no need for the operator to be in the vehicle other than to steer it because it's, it's highly automatic. But the most important part of the probe are its sensors. First of all, you can see the, the, the optical sensor. It's a red and an infrared optical sensor that measures the soil reflectance, which, which correlates well with soil carbon. So as the probe is inserted into the soil, it's continually taking readings. So you see exactly where that topsoil depth changes. So if you're mapping carbon or your soil health, or you just want a good topsoil depth map to be able to do variable rate inputs based on, on productivity, a topsoil depth map is really something that's never been available before, but it is now with the core scan. It also has an EC tip, which measures uh, soil texture. So just like the optical sensor, it, it gets a complete lithology of the soil as, as you're inserting the probe. So where, where that sand lens is, where that clay pan, you see that with the conductivity probe. It's a penetrometer. So there's a load cell in it that measures compaction, measures insertion force. You know, in, uh, compaction is called the hidden yield robber, partly because it's never really been managed well, site specifically. But now you can with the core scan because you can get a map that has the, the, the depth to certain restrictive layers. Finally, there's a moisture sensor here, a capacitance moisture sensor. Moisture is critical for a couple reasons. One is it's a great way to understand water holding capacity. But as part of the sensor fusion that happens in this probe, it helps understand compaction. You know, com soil can be hard because it's dry or it can be hard because it's truly compacted. And without a moisture sensor, there's really no way of knowing whether that hard soil is hard because it's dry or, or whether it's something you want to till up. But with the moisture sensor on it, you can tell exactly where that compacted soil is and, and the cause of it. It's also important to be able to collect core samples when you're in the field for calibration and for other uh, factors. We make it easy with a core sampler tube that mounts right on there, it takes just a few seconds to change over to this. We even include a sampler tray to allow you to quickly uh, remove the core and then segment it exactly where you want the segments to be analyzed. So that's the Veris core scan. We're, we're very excited about what it can uncover in, in fields, whether you're a researcher or a crop consultant or a farmer. We believe you're going to find a lot of new things in the profile that you've just never been able to find before. We've already found that on our own farm where we've uncovered uh, hidden yield, you know, causes of yield variability that we didn't know were there before. So thank you for listening.